Willie Mayette from PianoWithWillie.com. I want to welcome you to this tribute lesson on Richard T. Now, um, some students asked me for some Richard T. licks. I, you know, doing a search around the internet looking for some uh, Richard T. videos to pull some licks off of. Um, and I was listening on my phone. You know, I have a service in which I can, you know, uh, listen remotely to music. And I came across this. Um, the song called Richard T. So I'm listening to it, and it's by Big Boy Lemonade and Solid Gold. Let me just make sure I have that right, because it was kind of a weird title. <laughs> uh, Big Boy Lemonade and Solid Gold, and the album is called uh, Special Kind of Trouble. Um, and the song was called Richard T. It turns out it's just a pianist and this drummer. Uh, I'm not quite sure where they're located. I, I want to say they're in the UK, but I could be wrong about that. But you can find them on CD Baby. Uh, you can also find them on Amazon. And I'm like listening to this. I'm like saying, wow, this is a great progression. It's a really nice progression. So what I did was I took the chord progression, all right, and I created a new melody uh, over the top of it, all right. And basically the progression is that G down to D over F sharp to E minor, and then a 2 5 going to the C chord, and then D sus back to the G. And then the bridge goes to that E minor to the 4 7 chord, and then E minor, A7, which is 5 7 of 5, and then goes to the 5, and then it does the whole progression over again. Until finally at the end, we have. Four, five, one, five. Okay, this is a D sus chord, right, with a G there. And I go through all of the chords and, uh, you know, everything that I played in the introduction here, that's the whole arrangement. I'm going to show it to you note for note and uh, how it all works together. I'm also going to show you some uh, ways in which you can improvise around on the groove. So, you know, doing stuff like this. Uh, so kind of messing around with the groove and coming up with, you know, you know improvisational groove type stuff. Um, like I say in this lesson, it's not, uh, the, uh, um, the goal of this lesson is not that you're going to do you know, a single note in the right hand like that. Instead, what I want you to do is kind of get with this groove and um, you know, really start to expand upon the different elements that you can pull out of the arrangement. And I'm going to go through that with you as well in this lesson. Okay? So anyway, I hope you'll join me in the lesson, and I, I think you'll enjoy this one. It's a great sound.